Good morning. It's Monday morning, June 22nd. Our days are, our daylight is getting shorter. Um, hope you had a great weekend. Many of you were celebrating Father's Day and uh, we kind of just had a quiet day at home. So join me and prepare yourselves for prayer. You are wrapped in light as with a garment, O oh God. You ride on the wings of the wind. Let's be still and be aware of the presence of the holy within and all around. For the morning light and its irresistible dawning, for your untamable utterances of life in boundless stretches of space, and the strength of the waves of the sea I give you thanks, O God. Release in me the power of your spirit, that my soul may be free and my spirit strong. Release in me the freedom of your spirit, that I may be bridled by nothing but love, that I may be bridled only by love. Amen. Our scripture today, continuing with Songs of the Soul, is from Psalm 103. Blessed be God, O my soul, and all that is within me. Blessed be God's holy name, who forgives all our sins, who heals all our diseases, who saves our life from the pit who satisfies us with good as long as we live, so that our youth is renewed like the eagles. God liberates those who are oppressed and defends those who are wronged. God is merciful and gracious, slow to anger and firm in love. God does not look at us through our sins nor repay our falseness. For as the heavens are high above the earth, so great is God's infinite love. As far as the east is from the west, so far does God remove our wrongs from us. As a mother has compassion for her children, so God has compassion for the children of the earth. The love of God is from everlasting to everlasting. Heaven's faithfulness is from eternity to eternity. Blessed be God, O you angels and messengers of heaven. Blessed be God, O you creatures and families of earth. Blessed be God, O my soul and all that is within me. Blessed be God's holy name. And I'm continuing on with a few pages from Cleo Wade's Where to Begin. Change making belongs to all of us. You do not have to wait for anyone to tell you that you are in this. You don't have to wait around wondering what you should do. Get to work on what you can do. The time has always been now. Begin. A 
Let's reflect on the scripture and the poem. In the silence of our hearts or in spoken words, let us give thanks for the gift of this day and pray for the life of the world. For your goodness, O God, boundless and everlasting, thanks be to you. For your generosity, gracious and wise, thanks be to you. For your mercy, strong and free, thanks be to you. Let us share your goodness. Let us practice your generosity. Let us live your mercy that we and the world may be well. Amen. Well, Monday is the beginning of a, a new, I guess you'd call it workday week. In our culture, we have Sunday as the beginning of our week, but I think we often think of this Monday as a new beginning, as each new day is. So I'm wondering, what am I going to begin today? And I'm curious what you're going to begin today. Bless be your day.